Clutch Capix, week 14. All right, let's get started the Thursday game. Oakland and Kansas City. Oakland came back on Buffalo last weekend. Kansas City barely got past uh, Atlanta. Kansas City barely got past Atlanta. Oakland's offense is really good. Kansas City's defense is good. But I think Oakland's offense is going to win this battle, and I think Oakland's going to win 24-17. Pittsburgh and Buffalo. Pittsburgh beat the Giants last week, a hot Giants team, and they beat them. Uh, Buffalo, like I said, lost to Oakland last week. If Oakland and their big three were able to take down Buffalo, then I think Pittsburgh's going to have an easy time doing this. I think Big Ben, Antonio, and Le'Veon will be able to get the job done. I think it's going to be a high-scoring game for the Steelers. I think they're going to win 34-24. to The Chargers and the Panthers. The Chargers lost to the Buccaneers last week, and the Panthers were destroyed by the Seahawks. Uh, however, I think the Panthers are going to rebound this week. The Chargers, I think, will have a good game. I think it's going to be a pretty good game overall. However, I think the Panthers are going to get back on track. I think the Panthers are going to win 28-24. to Cincinnati and Cleveland, this one's easy. Cincinnati beat the Eagles last week. They looked good. They played a good game, and the Browns had a bye week. I think Cincinnati's going to win 27-14. to The Bears and the Lions. Where's the Tiger when you need it? Lions, Tigers, Bears, oh my. Detroit went into New Orleans last week. A hard place to win. A hard place to shut down Drew Brees, and they did it. Drew Brees had a bad game. Chicago destroyed San Francisco. Uh, however, I think the Lions are going to keep on rolling, and I think they're going to win 31-21 to against the Bears. The Texans and the Colts. The Texans didn't play that bad last week in Green Bay. Uh, they did lose, however. The Colts went off on the Jets. Andrew Luck went crazy, and I think this week the Colts are going to win 24-20. to Minnesota and Jacksonville. I think this is going to be an easy week for Minnesota. Jacksonville is a struggling team. The Minnesota offense does struggle, but so does the Jacksonville offense. I think Minnesota's defense is going to step up in this game. I think there's going to be some defensive scoring. I think Minnesota is going to win 31-20. to The Dolphins and the Cardinals. The Cardinals got a win last week against Washington, beating a hot Washington team. I was kind of shocked by that. In Miami, got destroyed by Baltimore. A lot of teams got destroyed last week. It's just a lot of high scores and then the other team low, low scores. I think Arizona has the better defense. I think that's going to help them win this game. Their offense will be there, but I think Arizona is going to win 24 to 17. Washington and Philadelphia. To me, this is like an American football game. Like Washington DC and then Philadelphia, like a very American city. And it just feels like a very American game. Washington lost last week and so did Philadelphia. I think this is going to be a pretty even matchup. These teams are pretty even to me. However, I think Washington has a stronger offense and I think that's going to help them win this game. I think they're going to win 27 to 21. The Broncos and the Titans. I feel like there's going to be an upset in this game. I think the Titans are going to win. Why? The Titans have been playing good this season. They scored high. They've been a great offense. The Broncos are not the same as last year, and I feel like with the way the Titans are playing, I feel like they're going to be able to overcome this Denver defense. I think they're going to upset them. I think a lot of people are going to be shocked by this game. I think the Titans are going to win 30-20. to The Jets and the 49ers. This is just a game of no relevance. Both of these teams are out of it. Both of these teams are not doing good this season. Uh, however, I think the better team is the Jets. I think They struggled majorly last week. But I think they'll get back on track against the easy 49ers team. I think the Jets are going to win 21-13. The Buccaneers and the Saints. Drew Brees struggled last week in the loss against Detroit. And Tampa Bay beat San Diego. New Orleans is not a good defense. And Tampa Bay is a very good offense, which I think will mean great things for them. I think the Tampa Bay offense is going to have a very fun day against the Saints. I feel like the Saints offense will play good, but I think just Tampa Bay is just going to keep scoring and scoring, and that's going to get them the win. I think Tampa Bay is going to win 35 to 24. Seattle and Green Bay. Seattle and Green Bay played many good games in the past. Seattle won last week. They destroyed the Panthers. I mentioned that earlier. And Green Bay beat the Texans. Green Bay's defense has been struggling this year, and the Seahawks offense is starting to catch. They're starting to pick it up. And I think that's going to continue. Aaron Rodgers seems a little bit hurt, and that's been affecting him a little. And the whole offense has been relying on him. They haven't had much of a run game, and he's been having to do almost everything. I think the Seahawks are going to win 34 to 24. The Falcons and the Rams. The Rams played in New England last week and lost. It's a trend that rookie quarterbacks play bad in New England and that continued. The Falcons lost to the Chiefs barely, only by one point. Uh, I think Atlanta's offense is going to shine in this game. They just have a really good offense and Jared Goff is still learning. So I think the Falcons are going to win 28 to 17. The Cowboys and the Giants. The Giants are the only team to beat the Cowboys this season. And I don't think that's going to happen again. Uh, it was the first game. 
and Dallas has learned since then. They've played way better. Uh, I think they've had time to understand and learn this offense with the new players. I think things are going to be different this time around. The Giants are playing good, but I think the Cowboys are going to win 24-21. to The Ravens and the Patriots. The Patriots are going to the playoffs, that's a given, and the Ravens are fighting for the playoffs. They are in first, but there are teams right behind them. The Steelers are right there. So they still got to win. These teams have played good games in the past. Uh, I think it's going to be another good game. Baltimore has a pretty good defense this year. Uh, the Patriots, of course, are a good offense whenever Tom Brady's quarterback. Like I said, I think it's going to be a good game. I think it's going to be a close game. But New England being New England, I think they're going to win 27-24. to 24. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. That was week 14 of Clutch Picks. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you next time.